Okay, yesterday I did an important upgrade to my Skywalker. I added a second elevator servo. Why? Redundancy. On a six-wing aircraft with ailerons, rudder, and elevator, the elevator is arguably the most crucial control surface. If you lose elevator control in flight, you are most likely going to land prematurely. Incidentally, a few days ago, I was at the field before sunrise, and during pre-flight checks, I noticed my elevator servo froze in place after only a few cycles of the stick. I was lucky to have this failure occur on the ground instead of in the air. If this had happened a few minutes into the first flight, there is a good chance I could have lost the aircraft. Even worse, I would never have heard the end of it from Grumpy Cat. So I went home, back to the drawing board, and decided to split the elevator into two pieces and run two servos with a Y connection. After carefully cutting out the bad servo, I used an X-Acto knife to carve all the way through the vertical stabilizer to make an open window. I super glued the two servo bases together first, then tacked them into place with CA after lining them up. Next I soldered the servo Y connections permanently for safety. Then I used more CA to glue the servos permanently and filled in the rest of the gaps with hot glue. This setup adds only a tiny bit of extra weight to the tail. It does add a bit of drag, but the servos are in line with all the other cameras and junk up front, so performance is probably only slightly affected. What I gain in peace of mind is immeasurable. Now, if one servo fails, I will always have a second independently operating elevator as backup.